Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Clean A Bit. Today we are going to be doing an unboxing of the new Apple Watch SE second generation. So if you are planning on buying one of these, stick around and find out what you get in the box and if it's worth your $249. Right now I am unboxing the straps and in this case we chose the color Starlight. Since this Apple Watch is going to be for my wife, she decided to pick this color because it matches her style better than mine. As you can see, I already have an Apple Watch SE on and mine comes in a midnight color. So it's a lot different than hers. All right, so now opening the second box, inside we find the watch itself. This is a 40 millimeter case and the color of this one is also starlight aluminum. So it matches the strap really well. It comes protected with a little plastic, but here you have it. It's very tiny, but it feels very heavy and well built. As always, Apple is known for that. Now over here under this uh, instructions we have a charging cable. This is a USB-C so you will need a USB-C plug to be able to charge your phone with this or like charging brick that has a USB port and after that we put the straps on the watch and just for comparison I want to show you mine Apple watch is a 44 millimeter but uh, this second one that we just on the open is the 40 millimeter so this is the size difference uh, my wife thought that the other one was way too big for her so we decided to go with the smaller one and here you go in conclusion do I believe that the Apple watch SE second generation is worth the $249 yes yes I do you get most of the functionality that you will get with the regular model 8 for about $150 cheaper. My only complaint is that it doesn't have the charging brick, that it only has the charging cable. So you have to supply your own charging brick. And I know that the old ones, it's rare for them to have a USB-C port. So that's an extra expense that you have to think about. And thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video and I can't wait to see you on the next one. Have a good one.